Hi, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant. And today we're going to be talking about how to make Goya tea. Goya tea is typically used to help curb the appetite for weight loss. Although these statements have not been supported by the FDA, a lot of people still use this tea for that purpose. Now, the first thing is you're going to have to find it, which may be a little difficult. But my recommendation is to either go to an herbal store or to a health food store to see if you can locate it in tea bag form. Once you have your Goya tea, you can then prepare your water for use in making the tea. You're going to fill your tea kettle with cold water. You're going to place it on your stove and turn your heat on high. You're going to allow time for the water to come to a boil. Once the water is at the boiling point, you can then remove it from the stove. You're going to want to make sure that your water has come to a boiling point so that it's the appropriate temperature to diffuse the herb throughout the beverage. What we're going to do then is we're going to take one of our tea bags and we're going to open it up. Now keep in mind you're going to want to use a cup that's between 8 and 12 ounces so that the tea doesn't become too diluted. Once you have your tea bag in your tea cup, we're then going to take the boiling water and pour it over top the tea bag, fully submersing it into the hot water. Now this is important so that the contents of the tea bag are fully getting diffused throughout the beverage and that there's no parts of the tea bag that are left dry. Once that's in there, you can then give it a few bobs before you let it sit there for a little bit. And make sure to leave yourself a little room in the top there to avoid getting burned because remember, you are using boiling water. Once you've poured the hot water over the Goya tea bag, you're going to allow it to steep for about two to four minutes or until you get the desired flavor that you're looking for. Now, it does have a very unique flavor. It actually comes from a pretty bitter melon. So if you want to help make the tea a little more palatable, you can add some sugar or honey to the tea so that it's easier going down. And again, if you're going to use this for weight loss, make sure you consult a registered dietitian or your doctor before using. Again, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant. And today we talked about how to make Goya tea.